The number of people died in devastating earthquakes in Turkey and Syria has exceeded 47,000. While aftershocks still continue in the region, 26 million people in both countries need help according to World Health Organization. Besides the Canadian government providing $10 million in earthquake aid, Turkish and Syrian Canadians mobilized just after the catastrophe and kept delivering aid to the region. Turkey's Consul General in Toronto, Sinan Mingan, is leading the aid campaign to Turkey. Uh, we started our campaign on the same day, on 6th of February. <clears throat> We've been collecting the most urgent items ever since. And <clears throat> we had two warehouses in Mississauga and North York. Uh, as of today, only North York warehouse is operational because the Mississauga warehouse is full. This is, of course, a good thing because people, not only Turkish Canadians, but from all communities, have contributed so generously. Mehmet Solmaz, a business person operating in the food industry in Toronto, opened his company's warehouse in Mississauga to the service of the campaign. People like us who has warehouse and certain logistic power, okay, let's use it. Uh, we have announced that we need more manpower, volunteer work, and, and, and I really, really, really appreciate it to all of them that we had hundreds of people voluntarily helped us in, in these situations and it's more than what we expected. Helping the victims of earthquakes in Syria is much more difficult because of the ongoing civil war. Still, Syrian Canadians are collecting aid materials to send to northern Syria. Rim Tantawi, a volunteer at the Health and Islamic Association in Burlington, is one of them. So we're collecting new, brand new blankets, tents and sleeping bags and we are sending them off to uh, Syria. Uh, lots of people have been displaced after the earthquake. They don't have shelter, it's very cold and um, we need to keep these people warm. There are also emotional moments as the relief efforts continue. I'll just show you one uh, note here. It says, um, Janam. Arkadaşım, geçmiş olsun. If you look at the message, it's a it's a toy. Kids are sending all sort of heartwarming, heartbreaking messages. Uh, it tells us this uh, humanities about everything, everything, division, religion, anything. People of all ages and backgrounds stand shoulder to shoulder in aid efforts. Of course, the kids too. Um, I'm helping uh, carry the stuff inside for the donations because there's an earthquake in Turkey. I carried in some donations like food, clothes, boots, and um, that's basically what I did. We, I also donated like $10 of money for bl blankets. For the Sheridan Sun, this is Mehmet Onur.